So today is the first day of Vlogmas 2019. And what Vlogmas is, is it's a thing content creators have been doing for a long time. A lot of my favorite YouTubers do it, but it's basically doing a daily vlog all of December. Now, I don't think I'm gonna be doing it daily, but I am planning on doing it more than once a week just because I am using this to kind of push my creativity, to push my drive, uh, to push myself really to film things throughout the day, to edit them, and to put out a video because I'm a little too hard on myself sometimes with my videos. I spend too much time editing. I am overly critical. I delete a bunch of footage because I don't like it. And anyway, I just kind of want to get out of that habit. So I'm going to use Vlogmas as the time to do that. So today starts Vlogmas. I am headed to the Phoenix Flea Market. It's small business Saturday today. So I thought I would bring you guys along so you can just check out the flea market and just kind of see what the day has. So we finally stopped to get some lunch and we waited probably like an hour in line to get this wood fired pizza right here which I think is gonna be worth it. It looks delicious, so. Um, I was getting a little bit hangry. There's a ton of people here. It's really awesome, but I'm gonna grab some nosh and then get back to shopping. <laughs> This entire pavilion is filled with this ficus elastica. I mean, it goes all the way to the roof. This thing is gigantic. What a babe. We finished with the flea market and headed home. Uh, there is one of my favorite ice cream sh places, shops, uh, in downtown Gilbert, which is real close to the house. So we're gonna stop there and get some ice cream and then head home. So now it is Vlogmas day one eve. I have to be honest, I took a bit of a nap when I got home just because for an introvert, it's, well, it's a lot being around that many people for that many hours. But I will say the Phoenix Flea Market was really fun. There was a ton of vendors and a ton of people there supporting these uh, artists and these small businesses. It was Small Business Saturday today, um, so just kind of cool to see that happening. But I picked up a lot of stuff and I just wanted to show you guys real quick just some of the things that I got from the flea market. One of the first things we got was this wall hanging. And it's got this beautiful like leather strap to hang it on the wall, but it's this almost like a saguaro cacti cactus, um, but I really liked this piece. If I can have the name of the vendor, I'll put it on the screen, or if I can find their website, it'll be down in the description box below, so you can check out all of these amazing artists. Next up is this candle from Vim and Vigor. These candles smell amazing. They had a whole bunch, but they come in this copper tin that actually can be reused and you can use this as a planter, you can use this as an accessory on your desk, etc. This candle is blood orange and lavender and it smells so good and this is a 
a soy candle. Do you ever wonder if soy candle is just a regular candle introducing itself in Spanish? From this business called Lettercraft, I got this amazing wooden pin of rose nylon, my golden girl crush. They had magnets, they had Christmas ornaments, so they had a bunch of really cool uh, just portraits of celebrities, all different kinds. Then going along with the wood theme, this company called Citizen made these ornaments. This one says Arizona Christmas, and then this Arizona state shape with a cacti in it. I thought these were really cool, so we picked these up. Now, one of my favorite shops that I got some things at at the flea market was Keep Nature Wild, and they had this design that I was absolutely in love with, so I got it on this beautiful t-shirt. Smokey the Bear, it's an awesome design, and I like it so much that I got a sticker, and also an enamel pin. This place had a lot of really cool stickers. Actually, they just had a lot of really cool everything, as most of the people did, but I did get quite a few stickers from them so I could just live my Visco girl dreams. This pretty sweet cactus sticker, rock on, ya prick. Keep nature wild. They had this beautiful wild sticker, which just is throwing out all the retro vibes. This sticker, which I love so much, again with the retro vibes, just outsider this give a damn and if you cover up the n it says give adam and last but definitely not least in the hall is this company local company called jar of buttons and then they had <laughs> the funnest pins and stickers i have actually gotten one of their pins from a local plant shop pueblo here in uh, phoenix and their booth was just awesome. Like, they had this sticker, which, if you don't know, is from the movie Drop Dead Gorgeous. This is Rebecca Ann Lehman doing her Why She Loves America during that beauty pageant. That movie is one of my top favorite movies. I will literally quote that entire movie every time I watch it. But as soon as I saw this sticker, I knew that this place deserved all of my business. So I got a sticker. I also got that in a pin. And then they just had all of these other pins and stickers, but here's just a few of the stickers. Tequila Me Softly. Nailed it. Uh, 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 uh. This one kind of goes along with my username. Can you not? And Whiskey Business. I was laughing the whole time, especially just after seeing this <laughs> Rebecca Ann Lehman pin and the owner of the shop even like knew exactly who this was so that was even great too there actually is one more thing that i picked up and it's this awesome mat can you see it can you see it i don't know what the name of this company was because i don't think they had a lot of like advertisement but they had a bunch of really awesome doormats and they had a lot of really funny and uh quirky and unique mats. That concludes Vlogmas day one. I don't I don't think I wanna say day one, episode one. I'm not sure if I'm gonna do these daily. Actually, I know I'm not gonna do them daily, but I do have a video coming up this week, which is going to be amazing. At least I think it's amazing. It's a collab video with two of my favorite people. So I really enjoyed my time spent with them, and I hope you guys really enjoy the videos that we created during that time. It's finally time to reveal them, so that'll happen this week. So I'm probably not gonna do a vlog every single day because I don't wanna overload you with my face or my boring voice. The whole point of Vlogmas was just to stretch myself and push myself creatively. I already feel myself thinking about the footage today and thinking that it all sucks because I didn't talk during it. It was just probably gonna be clips that I'm gonna put music to, which is kind of like my MO, but I still feel awkward vlogging in public. I felt awkward having my camera out today. That's the reason I wanna do this. I want to kind of break off that habit of like 
fear and insecurity and just kind of do what I want to do and not really care how I'm perceived by people. Yeah, I don't know. I just, I like watching vlogs. I like watching YouTubers that vlog. So I'm just trying to teach myself and learn how to do it well. And this is going to be a learning process. I'm excited for it and I hope you guys are too. And if you're not, then you don't have to watch these videos. I will actually have vlog in the title so you'll know that it's a vlog and not my normal planty content. Thanks for watching this. If you watched it the whole way through and I hope you enjoyed it and let me know down in the comments what your favorite thing was on the haul and stay tuned for more vlogmas. They want to be patches. <gasps> me, 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 me. Look. Do you see the microphone? <laughs>